It is time for a lunch break. Paint, colorful, finishing wallpaper, so many choices to spruce up your home. And Jeff Hester, the man known as Professor Paint, is here with the hottest new trends. Hey, Jeff. Hi, Micah. How are you? So I call you Professor. Hi, uh, Jeff's okay. Okay, all right. How you doing? Great. How are you? Good. What are we going to do today? Um, well, I'm here to discuss some, like new trends and okay. colors and stuff. And you know what today is? You know, we're talking about gas prices and oh. all the all the bad yeah. things. Yeah. It's nice to put some color in our life. Yeah. Warm make your life, up. your house, the sanctuary that it should there be. You right. Go. Make it fun. Yes. So I brought some stuff. This okay. is a Venetian plaster. It's okay. a very popular. It's actually a real old world finish that a lot of new manufacturers have started producing, mm -hmm. making it easier for you, the, the homeowner, mm -hmm. and me, the professional painter, to to put it onto walls. Okay. So this goes on walls and ceilings, and we're actually like going to take. Some, yeah, it's like chocolate mousse, oh, but you don't want to eat it. No. Um, Okay, so what we're going to do is we're going to do the first step. The okay. first step is you make sure your walls are prepared properly. You've got to have great prepared walls. If you don't have prepared walls, it's not going to last. Okay. It's a model with Hester Decker. Okay. So what you do is you take some of the product okay. and you put it on. This is a this is a like a, a sample board we call it. Okay. I'm going to let you do it while I explain okay. it. Right. What the sample board is is your walls are all smoothed and primed with an oil primer, and then you let it dry, obviously. And then this is your first step. So you it's just put a like a gold. Mm -hmm. is this, this is you have to pick this color too. Yeah, right? this comes in all different colors as Does you it can get, see. Supposed to get stuck That's like okay. That? Yeah, ah. it's okay. They add some texture to it. Okay. There you go. And leave some nice little zesty pock marks and oh, stuff. Okay. There you okay. go. Is that done? Yeah, that's okay. done. So now that's your first step. You leave okay. this dry for about four to five hours. Okay. Now I have one here. So with, it's a long process. It's a three-day process. Okay. But it's fun. So you okay. do it with the whole family, yeah, your right. husband involved, your your <laughs> kids. Okay. All right. Now what you do with the second step is you take the product, you put it on, oh, and then you totally again. take okay. it off. So we'll see what you're doing. Oh. You're filling in the voids. Oh, okay. So put it on. Cracks. There you go. And you totally fill in those voids. And that's what creates that, that depth, that, yeah. that beautifulness of the, of the finish itself. Oh, cool. It's made by a lot of manufacturers. They, they give demonstrations on how to, how to install it. You know, you can call us. It has okay. to be We can All explain right, it. So now that's your second Filled step. In. Okay. And now... When that all dries, it ends up looking like this. Why is it like two different colors? Well, when, as it dries, it comes out oh, like I that. Oh, I see. Okay. So let me take your tool. Okay. We're done installing. All right. Now, what I want you to do is feel that. Doesn't it look real thick? Oh, yeah, but it's thin. But it's real thin. Yeah, it's and cool. there's hardly any texture to it. I like but that. It looks like yeah, it's, really, it's really pretty. Right. And so now this is just one version. Now, would you just do one wall like this, or do you want to? You don't want to do all your walls like this, do you? Um, well, you know, the nice thing about doing sample boards yeah. is you can. Take it and move it around the room yeah. and see if you want to do it like. in all the rooms. Okay, gotcha. And it comes in so many different versions and so many different colors. This is a burnt orange. Oh, it's so shiny. Is it supposed and to be shiny? This is waxed. So oh. you take it one more step and you give it another step. So there's cool. so many different versions. Uh-huh. Uh, here's another one that actually has just like, like a brown that. suede look to it. Oh, I like that. That's and I it's like a really pretty one. look. Like a matte finish. Exactly. And all these can be done. They're all simple and easy and fun. Yeah. You know, this this is like a cement look almost. Oh yeah. Another one with a different tone with the with the with the little check marks. Yeah, it's yeah. Kind of now different. what's this right here? This one here is with a stencil. It's iridescent okay. with stencil. And it's and as you can see, as you move it through the room, it can yeah. change. Like it's a that. very unique finish. That is pretty nice. So you would have that and just spray it on, or just still do the little. You, you use the stencil okay. and you use the little brush and stuff. Okay. Do you have to buy? Is it expensive to buy all this stuff? Not really. I mean, okay. you can see the tools are relatively inexpensive. They're uh -huh. scrapers, knives. Uh, the material tends to get a little expensive, but okay. with the depth that you get, rather than just a plain flat wall, yeah, it just is a lot nicer. How do you know how much to get for your room? Again, if you go to the manufacturer, uh -huh. go to the store to buy it, you can give them the dimension of your room. Okay. They take the square footage and they'll give you they'll approximately give you a amount. So you don't need, have to keep right? running back to the store. No. Oh, I need a little bit more. Okay, that type <laughs> no, of thing. No, no. And, and again, the nice thing about it is there's nothing set. It's not, you can see by the movement yeah. and the changing of it, it's, it's unique. Yeah, and quickly, what colors are hot right now? Uh, oranges, yeah. browns, uh -huh. uh, yeah. any, any bright colors. So take a risk. You can always repaint, right? There you go. All right. Thank you so much, Jeff, for more information on this technique and where to attend classes. You can attend classes. You can check this out at our lunch break website, wgntv.com slash lunch break. And tomorrow, entertainment reporter Lisa Gibbons is in our studios. She's talking about her memory wall tour, an awareness campaign for dealing with Alzheimer's disease.